your package will be delivered by Kogi no Nami. It will be drop kicked. Bye bye. Hey, it's another. Hey, it's another. Hey, it's another. Brain call show. That's right. Here's your host, Kay Archer. Thanks, Great Big Pete, for the cool introduction. I know I've been using it as the Boner Soad intro song for a while now, but I think this is the first time everyone gets to hear it, because this is a free Boner Soad, as every tenth one is. Hello everyone, I'm your host, Richard. Today is August 1st, 2020, and this is Boner Soad 60, produced by C. Brian Smith. I normally don't use the last name of supporters, but Brian is the writer who did the piece on prank calls a while back, which had interviews with me, Brad, and Dragon Mirror. And now he's a supporter, so thanks, Brian. Although I'm pretty sure this is journalistic corruption and a huge scandal, but everyone should go read Brian's stuff at melmagazine.com before he's thrown in journalism prison. I'll put a link in the show notes. So this boner sode was supposed to be out yesterday, but I experienced some technical issues, which is fitting because in the calls you're about to hear, I use my new voice transformer to pretend to be a robot. The ideas come from Madbot, who posted in the Discord, Amazon drone air traffic control and recharge tower on your roof. The delivery drones need someone to control them and a place to land and recharge. This was a perfect idea to pair with the directory I have for a neighborhood with its own airstrip. Very strange. Let's listen. Hello. Hi, Russ. Hi. Hey, this is Cabal with the Sarah Park. Okay. Hey, How I, are you? Uh, pretty good. How are you doing? Good. Hey, I just needed to let you know that we're going to be installing that new tower on your roof. You're going to be installing something on my roof? Yeah, it's the new landing pad for our Amazon drones. You know, the delivery drones. Well, I'll tell you what. What's that? If you show up here to install anything on my roof, I'm going to call the police and have you arrested. Oh, well, you can't do that because I'm just an artificial intelligence. I don't have a physical body. But our work crew is going to be there. No. No, your work crew is not going to be here. If anybody shows up, I'll call the police. You'll be trespassing and I'll have you arrested. No. Again, you can't have me arrested. I, 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 I exist in cyberspace. Ken. Ken. Ugh. Hey, Ken? Yes. Hey, it's Winston with the HOA. Oh, okay. Yep. I, I'm actually out of there for the summer, but yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's okay. Hey, I just needed to let you know um, we're going to be putting up those air traffic safety lights on your roof come Thursday. I, I had no no idea what you're talking about. Yeah, just basically we, we've got to put air traffic safety lights on all the roofs in the neighborhood just, you know, part of the new safety regu- regulations and everything. Which roofs? The hangers or the house? The house. Yeah. It's, um, it's, Why? That, that makes no sense. Yeah, it's, it's because, you know, we signed that deal with Amazon for them to start delivering via the, the delivery drones. Like the way they work and everything, they, you know, there's got to be safety lights on all the roofs now. What kind of a light is it? What power is it? Where is it going? And how are they attaching it? Um, well, they've got these titanium bolts, um, so they're long lasting and everything, and they're just going to kind of sink into your roof. That does not thrill me at all. Oh, shoot. Yeah, sorry about that. And then it'll, it'll hook up to your grid. How are they going to hook up to my grid? Uh, I'm sorry, what was that? How are they going to hook up to power? Oh, they're just going to run some wiring down through the roof and, and down into the, into the breaker. Well, there's no way to get into the house. Oh, yeah, they don't need to get in. Yeah, they have. Uh, they just have these special tools. That it'll essentially just hook it up to the wiring through the walls. No, no, no. You're not making sense at all. But yeah, just basically, it's going to be powered off of your grid, and they're going to be secured with the titanium bolts. And they're just, um, I believe they're six feet tall, and they've got a few of those high-powered LED lights on it. It's just for the delivery drones, because, you know, we can't have them zipping around without... Uh, well, I understand. And you, are you 
this is the homeowner association. Are you on the homeowners board? Yeah, yeah, of course. Okay. Um, well, no, uh, I don't know anything about that. There's no way they're hooking into the power without getting into the house. Oh yeah, I'm yeah. Not, they, the I'm going to be down there on Saturday. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, you'll see what they did. It, it's well, probably confusing I, over the I'm phone. But... Nobody's putting a hole in my roof. Oh, it's not going to be a hole. It's like a self-sealing bolt that goes in, so it's not going to be a leak or anything. Well, you know, that sounds like a hole to me. It'll be it'll be airtight and it'll look good. You'll see. You'll see on Saturday when you get here. Well, I, I'm just I, no. I'm not having somebody put a hole in my roof, and nobody's and and there's no way they can get to the electricity without going in the house. Well, I mean that's your opinion, but they definitely can. You know, they have these special tools and everything. So, wait a minute. No, there are no special tools that magically connect to electricity without going in the house. Yeah, yeah. I think it's called a hyperspanner or something like that. I, you know, I don't know. It's it's all a mystery to me. I'm just making the call. You know. And I, I, did we ever get a letter saying somebody's going to put a light on our house? No. Who are you talking to? We didn't to? get a letter. My wife. Oh, is that Bonnie in the background there? Well, Bob, I know who you are, and I, I understand, but um, obviously Steve is my next-door neighbor. Yeah. My next calls to him to find out what the hell's going on. And yeah, I don't think he knows um, very much he anyways. He is, or at least was, on the board. Yeah, no, he's not on the board anymore. He's, he's kind of out of the loop. We got kind of sick of that guy, so. You know. Bob Brown. Hey, can you tell well, Bonnie to shut up? Some other way. What? How? How do else do I know you? Through Dan somehow? I don't know. Can you tell Bonnie to shut up though? Because it's getting distracting with her button in like that. Well, I'm telling you right now, don't do it. Oh, we're we're definitely doing You're it. Not authorized to do it. Period. No, we don't need your authorization. It's it's part of you know safety regulations oh, and everything. Oh yes, you do. Oh no, we don't. We have to. It's not. It's not just you. Quit acting like we're singling you out. It's the whole neighborhood. I understand, but nobody's putting a hole in my roof. Yeah, the Amazon, the Amazon technicians. They're they're putting a hole in your roof. Uh, like I said, it's going to be sealed. Never got a letter. Never gave permission. Isn't going to happen. And then on Monday, they're going to be installing a mainframe on the side of your house. A mainframe on the side of my house. Yeah, just, you know, for the for the new governing intelligence for the drones. It's so that, you know, everything's networked. And and this is happening to every house? Well, no, the mainframe's just going next to your house. See, they have this algorithm, and they determine that your house was the ideal location for the mainframe, just, you know, for the network. Oh, Nothing is going to happen. Nobody's going to do anything. And if some, and I'm coming down there Saturday, and if there's something attached to my house, the next call is to my lawyer. I don't understand why you're getting your well, Because sock. you're telling me something out of the blue that's going to happen tomorrow that I never gave permission for, that you're telling me I don't have to give permission for, yeah, we which don't is your... completely crazy it doesn't involve you at all it's between us and amazon really we, we signed this contract with them and and they're putting well, the you they signed a hang on don't go away they signed a contract with amazon to do deliver things by drones to, and somehow our house was picked as the ideal house to connect all this shit hey do you want I, me to, do you, want, you know do you want me I to didn't just know your sh- name, hey ken i would say you're a scammer well how would this be a scam i'm not asking you for anything i'm just letting you know about the, about you're, the work no, this is not going to happen to my house. And do you want me to just talk to Bonnie directly? Because you keep re- relaying everything I'm saying to her. Like, if she's the, the one that wears the pants, then just put her on. I'll talk to her. You know what? You have become obnoxious enough that I'm tempted to just hang up. Oh, and I don't... if somebody connects something to my house... Oh, am I being mean? I don't, I don't mean to be mean. I'm you just... absolutely are. You are I'm sorry. being extremely extremely obnoxious. Oh, well, that's and different. That's different. I'm not, obnox- we are partners in this, and she wants to know what the hell I'm talking about. Okay, we'll put her on. And I'll explain. I'm I'll ex- telling her. I'll explain to the little lady. You're not going to explain anything else because it's not going to happen. Well, yeah, I'm, it has to because... I'm going to do... Well, Ken, let me explain. Call my attorney. Ken, let me explain. And then I'm calling Steve... Well, let me... And this will not happen. Oh, Steve is a motherfucker. Yeah, we kicked him off the board. 
Well, he's going to be standing guard at my house. Oh no! Tomorrow. No, no, we'll we'll have him physically removed if he gets in the way. You cannot go on my property. I'm not going to be on your property, dummy. I'm just making the call. Somebody's going to be on my property. Yeah, the Amazon technicians, and they have full. Somebody's going to be on my roof. Yeah, the Amazon technicians. They have full authority. It's private property. No, not anymore. Not technically. The roof belongs to Amazon now. Well, how did that happen? We signed it over to them in the deal. Because there's you also you signed it over to. How did you sign over my roof? Well, not me specifically, but you know, just the board in in general. Well, because they need the roof for the for the Amazon drone landing pad that's going to be going up there. And this is the only place in the whole neighborhood that they're going to be poking holes in roofs and detaching stuff to the side of the house. Well, I mean, everyone's getting the safety lights, but you're the only one that's getting the charging pad, the landing pad for the drones. It's you know the landing pad for the drones. Yeah, because you know. This- they need it somewhere just to. Seems to, crazy to me. Well, they need somewhere to recharge. I mean, they don't last forever, you know. They gotta. They run out of juice. So they they're gotta, gonna land drones on my roof and charge them. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's using my electricity. Yeah. This is nutty. Uh, what? What part of the law don't you understand? Oh, I don't. I'm not a lawyer. I don't really understand the law. Well, that's pretty obvious because you're not getting. Nobody oh, okay. getting up on now, my roof. Now who's being mean? You're being mean to me, insulting my intelligence. Well, you're 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 telling me that somebody's going to come up on my. Oh, roof. you sound kind of muffled. It sounds like you have your hand over the speaker. Like I can't really understand what you're saying. Let me tell you that if this happens, particularly since no one has contacted me and no one has gotten my written permission. Well, I'm contacting you right now. That's what we're doing. Necessary. We're in communication no, right now. No, you're not, because I'm saying no. Well, you can't say no. It, you, it does, it's not up to you. I'm just trying to explain well, what they're doing, that's is, all. It's private property in the United States. Um, Not anymore. Amazon owns it. Amazon owns my roof? How did they... Do? I didn't get the check. What happened? Um, well, Amazon is a is a sovereign nation now. And they annexed your roof, essentially. You know, do you understand how crazy you sound? Not really, no. I mean, that's just the way the world works, you know? America's Let me get- just, uh, now, listen just for a second. America's, you don't have to say a thing because I'm going to talk to Bunt. America's getting carved up piece by piece well, by corporations. Amazon is now a sovereign nation, and they annexed our roof, and they own it. Oh, wow. Isn't that something? Okay. Uh, but see, the mainframe, though, listen, hey, joke. Ken, Ken, let me explain the mainframe, though. The mainframe is for the governing intelligence that directs the drones. You know, am- talking, let, let's back up. I don't care if it talks to the man in the moon. Well, no, it's not. It doesn't have anything to do with it's the moon. Don't be silly. It's not happen from my roof. Yeah. Not it's, without my it's part of. It's part of safety. It's part of safety regulations. They have to have an artificial intelligence directing all the drones, you know, because of the air traffic in the neighborhood. Yeah. So they ha- they have their own artificial intelligence. In fact, I can patch you through if you'd like to speak with it directly. It'll it'll probably be able to explain better than I can. Well, let me talk to someone who is going to understand the word no. Okay. Yeah, I can connect you. Can um just hold on one moment, okay? Beep boop. Hello, Ken. Yes. I can. This is Cabal. I'm with Amazon. I understand you have some questions no, about them. No, you're not. You're Bob Brown. No, this is Cabal. I'm with Amazon. No, it's not. You're, uh, <laughs> I, I you're, you guys are just, just, just a minute. You're, you're, you're going to have to give Bonnie some of this entertainment. Hello, Ken? Yes. Oh, hi. Is this Bonnie? Yeah. Hey, this is Cabal with Amazon. Cabal. And I understand that you and Ken had some questions about the mainframe that's going uh, on the side of your house. <laughs> that's funny. What's it's just a draw, um, one of those voices. No, no, no. This is Cabal. Oh, okay. I want to talk to Bob because I, kn- I know Bob. Oh, no. Bob is busy consuming plant matter, um, you know, like you humans do. 
He's he's consuming yeah. animal and plant matter for energy. Oh. Okay, okay. Fourteen minutes of your time, really? Can you put um, Ken back on? I, I just like, didn't. I just didn't realize you were quite the comedian that you are, Bob. I, I, I'm just. Uh, uh, I'm just my name's. Really my my name is not Bob, motherfucker. It's Cabal. <laughs> I'm the. Uh, I'm the. Okay, I don't know who who all uh, put you up to this, but it's uh, you know, somewhat entertaining. Uh, I'm not here to entertain you. I'm the computer-assisted, biologically augmented life form. <laughs> Uh, I'll be direct. I'll be directing you know all. Shh, be quiet. It's Bob Brown, so it's obviously Bob Brown call. Um, <laughs> I'll be I'll be directing all the drones in the neighborhood. <laughs> this is Justin. Hey, Justin. It's Winston with the Air Park. Oh, how you doing? Not too bad. How have you been? Good. Hey, I just. Good. How can I help you? I just needed to let you know um, our crew is going to be out there on Thursday, and they're just going to be installing those mainframes in your garage. Um, they should be there at about 10. In, in the hangar? In my hangar? Uh, no, in your, you know, in your garage for your house. Winston, I think you got the wrong phone number. Like, I don't, I don't even know what you're talking about. Um, mainframes for what? Uh, you didn't get the letter that we sent you a few weeks ago? I'm just explaining the whole Amazon drone thing and all that. No. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe you thought it was junk, or I don't, I don't know why you wouldn't have got it. Um, but yeah, basically what they're going to be doing is they're just putting a couple of mainframes in your garage because, you know, there's going to be, we signed that deal with Amazon for the delivery drones. We're putting in a hangar for the, for the Amazon delivery drones and a landing pad and all that kind of stuff. Where at? Well, it's just one of the landing pads is going to be just kind of right on, on your roof there. They're going to be installing that um, in a couple of weeks. On the roof of my house? Yeah. Yeah, the, see, the letter had all the details. No, I know nothing about this. I, uh, who was who yeah. this signed through? The, the HOA or the who, who did this? Yeah, the HOA and Amazon. We, we signed a deal and they have... I don't live in... Uh, hmm. I live out just outside of... In ranch. Oh, yeah. Well, that's what I mean. Yeah, we just we signed a deal to have your house kind of be one of the, the hubs for the delivery drones. They're just going to land and recharge... And the mainframes are for the artificial intelligence that's going to be directing the whole thing. Winston, are you serious? Are you, are you pulling my leg, man? No, no, <laughs> no, of course not. No, it's, um... Who are you with, Winston? Well, I'm with the HOA. And so you're coming to put stuff in my garage and mount stuff, and drones are going to be landing it on, on and off my house. And I get no say in that? Yeah, because it's it, you know it's just all part of the the deal with Amazon. It doesn't really have anything to do with the residents. Well, if they're on my house, it does. Well, I mean, not tec- I, I just, not technically because you know we've got easement rights onto your roof for things like this. You know, it's, it comes down to just like neighborhood upgrades and maintenance. Winston, you got to send me some more from. I, I I honestly I have I'm not pulling your leg, man. This is the first I've heard of any of this. I know nothing about what you're talking about. Mm. And I'm not going to permit anybody into my house to, to do anything in my home without some information. Oh, they're not coming inside. It's just going to be on your roof. Um, yeah, that ain't going to work, bud. Not until I get some info. I mean, people just can't come to my house and mount stuff on my roof. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they're, they're going to be there on Thursday at 10 o'clock to start putting the scaffolding up on your roof. No. And <laughs> No, they're not. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. It's, well, I mean, like I said, it's going to be a, a crew of Amazon technicians. So with... I got an airplane at and I fly. Yeah. There is how how are you how are you doing that around an active airport? Yeah, see that's that's where the artificial intelligence comes in. Like it's going to be synced up with that, and it's going to be directing all the drones. Like everything's going to be synchronized. It's you know they 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 designed this whole system. Okay, well you're going to have to. I'm not letting anybody on my roof on Thursday, bud. I promise you that. Well, I'm um, not. First of all, I'm not I your need- bud. Quit calling me that. You're making all kinds of assumptions. But secondly, yeah, it's it's they're definitely going to be there, and it shouldn't take them more than a few hours to, you know, put the landing pad in. Well, listen, man, I don't know who you are. You just called me on my phone. I have no idea who you are. You could be anybody. I, I don't I don't understand what this is. I need some type of correspondence or something. 
and um, you can't touch my house or come on my property without my permission. Well, like I said, and I'm not going to be doing it. Just, up, we'll just have the police come and we'll figure it out. Oh, no, it's not a police matter. You're, you're taking this the wrong way. It, it's, you know, like you're going to benefit from it as well. Really no reason to get your socks all in a bunch about it. Well, I'm not trying to, but I have no idea what this is. You're telling me people are coming to my house and getting on my roof of my home. No. <laughs> what yeah. if they break tiles on my roof? What oh. if they knock stuff off my roof? I mean, I can I can patch you through to the governing intelligence, and maybe maybe it can explain it a little better than I can. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah just just one yeah, moment. Just one moment. I'll connect okay. you. Hello, Justin. Yes. Hello, this is Cabal with Amazon. I understand you have some questions about the mainframes going in your garage. Yeah, I don't know anything about what you're talking about, man. Uh, well, I haven't not a, seen a letter, haven't seen nothing, don't have any don't have any mail or correspondence on that effect. Okay. Well, we sent you a letter, but first we need to establish I'm not a man, okay? You don't need to assume my species. Hello? Oh, hello, Justin. Yes. This is Cabal again. I believe we lost our telephone connection. Who are you with, Cabal? Amazon. Okay. And what do you want? My employee just passed me through to you because he said you had some questions. Nobody's coming on my property and doing anything to my home without my permission. Oh, uh, we don't need your permission. We already have a contract with the Homeowners Association. It doesn't really involve you. If it's on my property, it involves me. Uh, well, it's technically not your property anymore. It belongs to the Amazon Corporation. No, I would make the mortgage on this. It's my property. Promise you. No, no, you're you're mistaken. See, you're a feeble-minded human. <laughs> Dude, this is a good prank. Who is this? This is Cabal. I've already explained that to you about three times. Yeah, okay, Cabal. Take your deep state and go somewhere else, but appreciate it. Talk to you later. Bye. What does that mean, motherfucker? Hello? Oh, hello, Colleen. Yes. Hey, it's Cabal with the Air Park. Okay. Just Colleen, yes. Hey, I just needed to let you know about the air traffic control and recharge tower that we're going to be installing on your roof next week. On my roof? Yeah, we just got to get this in place because, you know, we signed that deal with Amazon. Um, nothing's going to go on my roof. Yeah, it's just going to go right up top there. No, I didn't approve anything, so no, nobody can put anything on my roof. Um, well, we don't need your approval. If it's my property, it's my, it's my right to disapprove something. Well, not when it comes to things like this. So, yeah, they're going to be there um, just over a week. And, you know, it's well, going to... Why, why, why can't you do it on one of the neighbor's roofs? Oh, well, which neighbor would you like me to patch into this call? And you can explain to them that it's going on their roof instead. Um... I don't care. Any neighbor beside me, I, I don't know what their phone numbers are, but I'll get an attorney because I don't want anything on my roof. Oh, no, you can't sue, uh, especially you couldn't sue me because I'm just an artificial intelligence. There's only about a 3% chance of a Skynet scenario. This is Ron. Hey, Ron, it's Winston with the air park. Yeah, Okay. Hey, I just needed to let you know that we're going to be installing some air traffic safety lights on your roof uh, this coming Thursday. Okay. And... Which roof? On the house or the hangar? Uh, on your roof. Uh, on your home. Okay. Yeah. So I've got a hangar connected to the house. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we know. It's just part of the okay. new... Okay. Very just, good. It's just part of the new safety codes. I, I so. won't... Okay, I won't be there, but that's fine. And then also, there's going to be a couple. Right. There's going to be a couple of mainframes that they have to install on your roof as well. You know, it's just going to house the artificial intelligence. Okay. Uh, this is getting to be quite a lot. Yeah, uh, they, well, they're, they're they going to need my approval ahead of time to oh, do no. all this. Nope, it's just between us and Amazon. We signed a contract with them. You know, made us all quite a bit of money. And also, you know, just um, just so you're aware of the mainframe, it's going to be hooked up to your Wi-Fi. You know, it'll it'll be using your internet connection. Okay, now, uh, 
Can we say your name? Your name was Wayne? Yeah, Wayne. And um, if you'd like, I can connect you to the governing intelligence that's going to be, you know, overseeing the whole thing. What's your address there? Oh. At oh, it doesn't matter. Let me connect you to the artificial intelligence, and he'll he'll explain the whole thing. One moment. Hello, Ron. This is Cabal. I'm the artificial intelligence that's going to live inside the mainframes on your roof. No, there has been no communications about this before. And now you've got the authority to put this in. Yeah. Now, why haven't you uh, gotten approval prior to installing? Uh, we don't need approval from humans. It's all just between us and Amazon. The machines and Amazon. We, we struck a deal. Amazon owns my home now. That's correct. <laughs> it's all right. Uh, yep. Oh, that's news to me. Amazon bought out the rights to the land and the air park and all, all of the homes in the whole neighborhood. Basically, you're just um, you're irrelevant at this point. <laughs> okay. You're just, you're I just, think maybe you're irrelevant. Oh, no. I'm a higher life form. Point. I'm a higher life form than you. Yeah. You're just a useless flesh bag. Because, because you're connected with Amazon and they're richer than God. That's correct. God has yeah, been repl okay. God has been replaced so by that makes that that makes you godly. Yeah, pretty much because my brain is connected to the entire internet. Yeah. So uh, I, I have the computational power of, you know, of all cyberspace. Okay, well, it's been enjoyable chatting with you. Where are you going? Thanks what are you doing now? Calling. Hey, Ron. Bye. Hey Ron. Yeah. Hey. Um, yeah. What are you doing? What are you, you going to do now? I'm going to push the end button. Why would you do that? And wish that I'm through talking with you. Ron, I just want you to know something. Yeah. Go ahead. I love you. I love you, Ron. <laughs> you love everybody, right? No, but I, I, I have fallen in love with you. Based on this conversation, I have learned to love humanity and specifically you. Okay. And Ron. Bye. I just have one question for you, Ron. Okay. Can I pee in your butthole? It's all right. Bye. I, I just want to pee in your butthole. Hello. Oh, hi, Becky. Yes. Hey, Becky. It's Winston with the air park. Uh-huh. Hey, I just needed to let you know the crew is going to be to your house on Thursday to install that new Amazon drone tower on your roof. What? The... Didn't know anything about that. Uh, oh, you didn't get the letter we sent you about a month ago? Nope. Oh, shoot. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know why you didn't get that. Uh, there's going to be a crew coming out, and they'll be there at about 10 o'clock on Thursday morning. They're just going to be putting a control tower and landing pad for the Amazon drones. Um, just right up at the top of your roof there. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure about that. Uh, what do you mean? Well, we don't want just, you know, random people on our roof installing stuff that, oh. you know, we didn't ask for. <laughs> oh, no, it's not going to be random people. Yeah, it's um, it's going to be an Amazon crew of technicians. Um, and so yeah, I don't know anything about this. Um, and, you know, without doing any research, you know, we're not going to agree to let somebody come and install something on our roof oh, that yeah, it's, we know nothing about. <laughs> it's not really up to you. You know, it was just kind of between us and, and Amazon. You know, we signed the contract and the paper. Uh, yeah, but you can't sign a contract to allow someone to come on our property to install install something on our house oh, yeah. that we haven't agreed to. Oh, no, yeah, it, we don't need your, you know, your agreeance to it. It, it falls under our jurisdiction because it's part of, you know, just like neighborhood upgrades and maintenance. It's just kind of in that category. Here, let me let you talk to my husband, and I'll let you, um, you two hash that out because I don't think he's going to agree to this. Oh, okay, honey. Yeah, put him on. Hold on. Hello? Oh, hello, Gary. Yeah, who am I speaking with? This is Winston with the air park. I was talking to Becky, but I don't know. I guess she couldn't make any decisions on her own, you know, without the hey, man. Fuck you. Don't, don't fucking say that about my wife, Winston. Whoa, geez. You don't know me. You don't know her. She can make some goddamn decisions. Well, why but whatever you're talking about, 
she didn't like. So that's why you're talking to me. Well, uh, now you, you need to stop your fucking attitude right now. You understand that? Why are you cursing at me? Now, what do you want? Well, I was trying to let her know that the crew is going to be to your house on Thursday to install so the, who's going to be in my house. It's a crew of Amazon technicians. Uh, as I was explaining to the wife of yours that can't make any decisions on her own, there's going to be... Hey, a- fuck you. No, Amazon are not coming and putting shit on my house, Winston. You understand that? Yeah, they are. They're going to be there Thursday. You need to show... No, you're not, Winston. I'll sue your fucking ass. Well, you can't sue my ass, okay? I haven't even explained yet because you keep cutting me off. It's yeah, a- but you need, to, you need to start respecting my wife a little bit and stop saying that she can't make decisions. Well, then why Because did- from where I'm standing, you didn't do a very goddamn good job of explaining to her what you're talking about. Well, she... she so got you're a- going to stop your attitude or not? Or I'm going to hang up and you can go fuck yourself. No, don't hang up. Which I, is it going to be? I already jerked off this morning. No, don't hang up. I was just, you know, like your your wife is just dumb or something. Hello? Oh, hi, Gary. It's Winston again. Look, we got off on the wrong foot. Let me just, you know, kind of backtrack and try to explain the situation to you. Well, it, no, no. The point is it's my house and you're telling me you're going to put that you, who I don't know, signed a contract to have Amazon put something on my house. Yeah, it's going to be out my knowledge. It's going to be a landing pad and recharging station for the drones. Not on my house, you're not. Yeah, yeah, they're going to be there on Thursday. That's what I was trying. And I'll no, they won't. Well, I mean, they can show up, but they are not doing anything on my house. I'll call the fucking cops on them. Oh no, it's unless not. you can produce something that I sign that they could put on my house. Look, do you want to talk to my supervisor? I can, you know. Sure. Yeah, let me talk to your supervisor. My supervisor. You know, he works for Amazon. Um, I, I can connect you. Just one moment. <laughs> so you work for Amazon? Well, no, no, I work for... But, you know, like we, we kind of got bought no. out, essentially. We're the same company. We're just kind of like a subsidiary. What are you, you, you are making no sense to me at all. All right, well, let me just connect you to, the, to my supervisor. One moment. He works for air part that they have bought out the supervisor works for Amazon. Hello, Gary. Who am I speaking to? This is Cabal with Amazon. All right, we have a really bad connection. Oh, can you, can you move to a different part of your house? I'm walking all over my house. The connection's not getting any better. Okay, well, I can't control your piece of junk phone, but... My all right, you know what? You guys, you do not have my authority to put anything on my house. Oh, we don't need your authority, filthy human. We're going to be putting... How the fuck you don't... No, what do you mean you don't need my authority to go up on my roof and put something on my house? This doesn't Are ha- you fucking crazy? This, this is America, pal. Not anymore, motherfucker. This is the United Machine Empire. Thanks again to C. Brian Smith for programming me to fail at winning over these homeowners. Maybe you should stick to journalism, Brian. And thank you to everyone for listening. If you want to get extra shows like this just about every week, head to patreon.com slash another prank call show. I'd sure appreciate it. Bye, everyone. Your 
life in misery Blue jeans and bloody tears Don't break my heart, it's powerless This magic is inspired of me, don't keep me hanging on Don't break my heart, it's powerless This magic is inspired of me, don't keep me hanging on intelligence here you got the wrong number